so what if you've got a dog and um and it's going through uh, you know emotional reactions maybe it's partly traumatized missing its last home uh, and it's like a, it's almost like you've got a new child which is traumatized that you're looking after and you feel like you're the mother or the father uh and what does the dog need well you know the most the most powerful thing uh to give anything is the radiance of love the highest radiance of love is the most healing i mean like if if something's traumatized you can give it antidepressants uh you can put the tv on for it <laughs> put the tv on for it um and um and then leave it uh, but for you know like for example you know what if you had someone who's totally depressed uh, and is is listless in apathy and is feeling suicidal and they not they're not willing to take any action so the, the thing that has got a great chance apart uh, of lifting them up until they've got the energy to look after themselves and be happy themselves is the energy of of the transmission of love love so love is what does that what does love mean and miracles do happen i mean hawkins actually many of you may know this from hawkins book so that he was a psycho and this will answer the question with the dog as well so there was this patient he had he was kind of like very difficult i think it's from the letting go book and uh and he would try and help her, but it seemed to be there was nothing he could do, no, no therapeutic or, or advice he could give her. So he let go of trying to control the patient or try and make them well or give them another, another advice to do. And he just sent them love in, in his thoughts on a regular basis. Um, and, uh, and, and over a period of time, he did still have contact with them. They got, they got, they got, be they got much better. He saw that a lot of the things were falling away. So if I had a, a pet or if I thought it was my child, I did ha have that with a pigeon. Um, and uh, then actually what I regret when it died was that I had not radiated more love and time with it, more presence, uh, because that's what it really wanted from me. And when I left it alone, when I wasn't giving it love, I saw there was the grief of not having been present and radiated as much love as I could. And the power of love uh, and your presence radiating out love to a dog, to a cat, to your partner, to your parents uh, is actually the most, even if it hasn't got the energy to love itself, is it may you may radiate enough love um, to it. Now, the quality of love is, is different. You know, how do you become the highest radiance of love? Well, when you want to control something for your own ends and you're trying to love it, then the light bulb is less intense. So the healing is less intense. Uh, I want to love this dog, but I want it I want it well by tomorrow so that I can live my life. You know, um, well, that's still a lot of love you can give it today. Um, but then there's something in yourself because the love is conditional. The love is um, the love has a limitation to it. There is a, a an expectation or outcome. Or I'm going to love this dog for today, but tomorrow I want it to be well and happy. Well, th that love, in a way, you're radiating out love for today, but there's limitation in the background. It's it's love with 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 control, if you like, or with limit limited unconscious programs. So, so if you really want to love something. Give it as radiate out is your presence, the presence of love. It's not the words, not really the actions, but the words and actions come out of the radiance of love. That how pure a love channel are you for for a dog, animal, parrot, whatever it is. Now, probably if you spend enough time with something radiating out enough love and clear the blocks in you to loving it more, so you're a higher light bulb of love. Um, miracles will tend to happen you'll facilitate that for the dog um yeah you know that's uh, anyway that's my thing of what's the strongest medicine for for a dog or even a child really um okay stop it there